So just trying to um, find 10 items for today. I'm not going to do the 20 uh, Paul Potter like I said today because it's far too late. I've been out all day. It's been very busy. Uh, so I was just looking in my boxes and I forgot I had this. Um, I got a lot of Denby stuff really cheap from St. Peter's Hospice. Like really cheap as in creamer and sugar for one ninety nine, And I absolutely love this sugar pot. It's lush. Um, I might as well get this listed. I don't know why it's just sat in here. I want to get this box down. And then that'll be that top shelf clear if I get that done. That red jug is absolutely beautiful. If you've not seen it, let me show you it. Hey everyone, it's Joshua. Welcome back to the channel. Today's 10 is going to be a little different. I'm not sticking to the plan I had yesterday of doing the 20 pool pottery because I was busy all day. So I thought I would clear a shelf. Um, I showed you in the clip probably somewhere, it would be either before or after this, um, of the shelf that I've cleared because then I can unload the stuff I've listed this week onto there which I thought would be better. So this 10 is going to be a little different. It's a mixture of stuff that I've had hanging around for far too long and it's time to clear it and get rid of it. And let's do the best one first. Some of you might remember this beauty. I've chose this space today because the lighting will really show this off. It's a beautiful hobnailed uh, picture jug with a P stamp on the bottom. Now I'll put a little picture up here of something that I found that's in green for £24. But I plan to sell this with some uh, jugs, some picture jugs, or chalices, I should say, for about a hundred. Uh, I don't really want to be shipping this on its own, so I think a hundred would be perfect for it. It's a really nice ruby red. It's very heavy. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, so I'm more than happy to sell that. I paid £10 for this. So for this... And I believe six of these, again, red chalices. They're not all the same, but that's fine. I'm going to sell them as they are for £150 and I'll lower the price slowly. I need to keep looking at that lot, not there. I've changed the camera around. Anyway, so that's listing one. Second listing are these Tremar uh, side plates, lunch plates. I think there's six of them. Uh, they're not all stamped Tremar, but some of them are. I got these for free at the garage rummage sale thing that me and Carla and Lex went to in Midsummer and Autumn like a year and a half ago now to I think it was in Covid I can't remember exactly where but I've had these for ages about £20 for the six I believe. Now in the earlier clip you would have saw the Denby stuff that I'm listing today sugar and creamer I paid one ninety nine. Uh, they usually go for about £10 and £15 this one might go for more because it's larger this is a much larger sugar and creamer than usual. A Mr. Fussy and Little Miss Trouble 2014 Mr. Men and Little Miss Egg Cups. I'm worried these were given out like Easter eggs, but I've not had issue selling Easter egg mugs before, like the ones they used to do in the, the mugs, the Cabri ones. Yeah, I pay 99 pence each. Uh, even if I get a tenner for both of them, that's still a fiver profit, so I will hopefully give that a go. And then the five Denby cereal bowls, probably 24 99 30 pounds, depending on the um, shade. I haven't looked this pattern sort of shade up yet. Uh, some are worth more than others. This one is actually really quite nice. Side plates. Oh, for the bowls I paid $3.99 for the bowls. Plates here I paid $4.99 and there's six of them. Again about £20. And then I've got six slightly larger ones, again, for £5. Again, same sort of price, £24.99, £30.99. Really just depends. And the last two items, I promised myself I'd get a good chunk of Pyrex listed and gone, and I have been selling some of it recently. Uh, I get rid of this Pyrex lid that's very dirty, has a slight bit of damage, a bit of a chip on that top corner there, as you can see. It still sells for about £7 plus postage. And I'm going to get rid of this. I've not seen that pattern before, so I can't tell you the name off the top of my head. I'll put it on the screen. Uh, but get rid of this large casserole dish. Um, it's great condition. And it is a uh, Pyrex. So slightly more modern than the JAJ stuff. But not a pattern I recognise. So we'll hopefully get about 20 quid for that one. We'll see. And that's everything for today. I am very, very busy trying to sort my room out. Um, it's not going too well. You mean your room is just a mess and you're trying to sort the mess but there's nowhere to put the stuff you've sorted so it becomes even more of a mess. 
I'm at that sort of stage at the moment where I'm kind of moving one mess to another and then another mess to another. But I have got, as you can hear that, a box going to We Buy Books. It's only about £10 worth, but it's about 25 books out the way, so that's a bit of space. I'm also going to be taking out the clothing that I've got and try to condense it and move it somewhere else because that's taking up a shelf space that I need at the minute for stamp storage. Um, so just kind of trying to move things around to better fit the room. Um, I'm hoping to condense your on some boxes at the minute, some of these down so that I can kind of fit more listed or unlisted stock into them and free up some shelf space. So I'm going to be very busy this week, but I will catch up on that one day as I promised and I'll see you all very soon.